Good afternoon to all and welcome to our afternoon session here. We have a team of people here with their radio control time jets. Chris Cole's here with the Rumsen Elephant. The backfire. Forward and then after the second circuit the wings will retract. And my colleague will when they're going to be retracted. Watch. All swung backwards. Wings forward at the moment. She's away. Nice, gentle, smooth takeoff. Now you're watching history being made here this day, at the 10th anniversary of our ducted fan meeting. Ladies and gentlemen, Chris Colson, champion of champions. He's a wonderful, nice. If you ever see his beautiful paintings. He's such a multi-talented man. If you go into shops and see aircraft paintings, cards and calendars, it's Chris that actually paints them. He's a beautiful fly. There it is. Extended forward the wings there. Look on me. Now watch that. You see the wings will be swung back after a circuit. One of the engines sadly not going as fast as it should be. Keep your eyes on the wings themselves because it's got a closed loop service system. Swing rings operating now. Watch the wings. Look, look. They're going back now. Look. And there they go. One thousand three hundred and twenty miles an hour this aeroplane would go in Russia. Very, very fast. The wing's back now then. Chris, don't forget you used to stop the show with his swing wing tornado. There. Look absolutely magic. When you think of the aeroplane made of blue foam and cardboard. And this is the way he just cuts them to pieces, these aircraft. Very quick at building them. Only taken a couple of months to build that aeroplane. But next year, he promises us... Now he's going to go for a roll here on this history-making day. Will it roll? It will roll. Easy peasy. <laughs> a lovely aeroplane indeed it is. On the tail plane of the full-size aircraft they've got two. 23mm cannon, remotely controlled there. A very fast meat machine indeed. As I say, watch this space for next year's surprise at this show, because the Phantom will be flying. Now the wings are going to sweep forward now in flight. Watch this, the closed loop system happening along now. Very, very expensive bit of kit up there at the moment. Two Rossi 19, Rossi 90s. 240 pounds a piece there, plus the tune pipes and every other bitty bob that goes with it. So you're watching something like 3,000 quid's worth of aircraft, to say nothing of the time involved. The Russian aircraft then folds, ladies and gentlemen, an ex-commander on the RAF, his own squadron of course. He used to fly all sorts of jet aircraft, and then sad to say, he discovered he had this diabetes, like an awful lot of people, and now he's totally grounded, sad to say. On finals, ladies and gentlemen, and he's all British, he's all singing, he's all dancing, his own design, yet again, he stopped the world with his Concorde, don't forget. Now, there's going to be a Joe parachute coming out of this aircraft when it comes down to land, let's see it. And I want you to hit it big if it does, if it doesn't even. Wonderful, wonderful man, Chris Golds, ladies and gentlemen. Not yet. You get ready. Here it comes. Look. Oh, come on. A big one. Thank you, Chris. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. What a man. Now, in theory, that parachute should blow off now. Well, not blow off. You know what I mean. It should ejaculate, no, not ejaculate, it ejects the word. <laughs> I'm getting all, you know, 
word I mean, don't you? Yeah, that's it. I don't drink. 